Hi again guys, I'm back for another video. In our last video our stone warden kind of fell a little bit flat, so we're gonna make it we're gonna make another one. I, I think I really deserve to give that wait, what? Did I load the wrong I think I loaded the wrong version of the game. No? Why isn't it appearing? Did I not get logged into my profile? No? I'm on. That's weird. see why that's not appearing. Well, that's just weird. There it is. Okay. I'm going to take a little more varied approach, I'm going to put more points into Constitution as we level up. I think that was part of my mistake. Um, I really should have had more con than I did when we got as far as we did. But I hadn't put a single point into it, so I think that that was just a contributor to why I uh, had so much trouble there. And the truth is, I, I probably don't need to raise strength for at least a little while. At least not as much as I was. Just enough to keep up with the armor gear curve. Because I was doing fine on armor, I didn't have any problems with it, so trying to shoot for that last tier of the armor mastery was really a mistake. So I really appreciate about this is um, the Stone Warden just does an easy, easy, easy start. There's almost nothing in the starting area that can really out-damage your armor at this point. But that guy came close. There's just a lot less hiding behind um, Norgan than I'm used to. seen him spawn in here before. Okay. That was completely unexpected, though not un unappreciated. That's a hell of a thing to find this early. Well, shit. We're off to a great start already. We got a Rune of Reflection, which will go really nicely with, uh, the rest of the damage reflect options that we have on this character, so. If we find anything else worth equipping, really nice armor. Okay. Impenetrable is just a ridiculously great armor mod at this level because of so many enemies that do physical damage. The auto-explore seems to have improved a little bit since 43, but I just might be going crazy. Difficult. 
and the Summertide file was just laying on the floor in his room. By an organ. Now we're gonna move on to Deep Bellow. I'm gonna try and get us as close to where we were before we died in the last video. My feedback seems to be that my videos are actually too short lately, so I'm gonna try and go back to the 30 minute format since it seemed to be just working out and was a lot more um, natural and fluid. Plus it's a lot easier to clear the later dungeons in 30 minutes and I don't have to break the video up into so many pieces. some kind of ranged attack. I don't know if I have any available. You know what? I haven't leveled up since my first level up. Wow. Okay. Um, let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, I don't feel too bad about that mix. Wait, no. I want to get my magic up one point so I can get Eldritch Infusion. And we'll max this and start maxing Eldritch Blow. It's easy when I get in the zone to just forget that I have level ups altogether, which isn't a good habit to be in, so try not to do that. diseases on us. Oh my god. That would have been really bad. I have no idea what happened there. Was there a corrupter enemy up here? What the hell did that? Was it just the... did the Drems do that? Bleeding. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of at a loss there. We had diseases and stuff on us. It must have be those those granivores do it. I just never usually have them alive long enough for uh, the chance to actually see it. It's a lot of dragon hatchlings up there. spawning where they're not supposed to. It's just one life. I really need to be more careful than that, though. Now we can raise strength a little bit, just so I can get that the ability to equip a heavy plate when I start finding it.
<laughs> won't let you hide behind uh, scenery anymore, I see. It's still a pretty terribly easy boss fight. mental and care physical. Thank you for that. some money on that. Pilt's tree trunk. Oh wait, well it's one less item for me to accidentally find later on when I could have gotten something good and useful, so... I'm not terribly thrilled with the contents today. I wonder if we can beat Ben at level 7. I bet we can. Given how defense and armor oriented we are, we should be able to handle him. And he could be a good experience boost. Yep, he wasn't too bad. I think this time around I'm going to do the elemental splits and um, see how these are. Go kill Bill. Those are cute. Look at that.
did they just hit me? Earth and missiles. Yeah! What the hell? That's horrible. That's really bad. They do a lot of damage, but I don't know if I want to take that earth and missiles hit all the time. I mean, I guess they should be fine as long as I'm careful about how I use them, like not putting them in a position where they're going to be standing behind me in a narrow corridor or whatever, but... Because he doesn't seem to aim it on me, at me on purpose, either. It's, it seems to only be happening when I'm moving around after casting them, so... Gotta get that equilibrium down. I like these. Yeah, I'm going to keep leveling these. smoothly. And here's Prox. Ah, awesome. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Jesus, it's a bulwark. Yeah, it's a bulwark. I'm like, why is my damage so low? Holy crap. And he's a coward, too. What is that six damage hit I keep seeing? Apparently it's nothing important. It's probably damage reflect. Yeah. But wow, I'm hitting hard now that I got that new shield. Do I have anything else here? Wizards, copper, ring of time. I do use magic. And I'll use the pickaxe. I'll hold on to that. You know, I don't, I don't have anything that scales with cod. It's in my health, so I don't have to hold on to it for gear or anything, at least. Okay, I got 26 strength, so if I find any steel plate, I'll be able to wear it. And then I'm just going to sit on it for a while um, and pump willpower. I think willpower, yeah. Well... 
Yeah, willpower is going to be what I want to raise before magic, I think. Too many things scale off willpower rather than spell power. Oh, that's terrible. I'm sorry. Drakes sure do seem to be appearing a lot more. That wasn't too bad. Got an emblem of evasion for our trouble, which raises dexterity, cunning, and luck, none of which are useful to us. Still, it's better than what we have, and the use effect on it is, um, is pretty boss, so I can't complain. Alright. God, that second point was actually pretty nice. I feel like I should try leveling the Stone Fortress Resilience of the Dwarfs combo for reduced spell damage. Yeah, I'm gonna have so many free generic points in this character anyway. I think I'm gonna do it, just to see how it works out. I mean, worse comes to worse, it's what, you know, a, a magic damage juggernaut? I mean, that's not bad, right? Might as well do the arena now. That was pretty easy. Alright. Let's see how well this does. Resilience of the Dwarves. And then I'm going to put a point to Stone Fortress next level. And then the next time we fight a big group of casters, we'll see how good the damage reduction is. Sometimes the only way to find out whether or not something's going to be viable is to test it, you know? doing pretty well on money at least. Dollar dollar bill. Dollar dollar bill. Okay. Do we have anything that raises our saves or our immunities? I don't think we do. Like the deep rock, when you're in deep rock form you get it. Hundred stone. That's all just one spell being buffed. Spell stone. Well, body of stone gives resistance, but you get rooted into the ground. We'll probably invest in this tree eventually, at least for crystalline focus, which is just amazing. 
especially considering how much physical damage we'll be doing. Yeah, we don't. We don't have any way of increasing our stun resistance through talents. So that's something we're going to have to keep an eye on later on. Granted, our saves are going to be really high. Like, really, really, really high. Missiles really hurts. I gotta be careful not to do what I just did there. Like dumping him in the middle of the corridor was really dumb of me. What a great ring for this build. interesting here? I don't think so, besides the ring we found. Yeah, nothing I particularly feel inclined to use. The big rock spike AoE doesn't seem to hurt, just the earth and missiles, so that's what I'm going to have to watch out for. What a neat ability, though. I would say it probably still needs some work, but... see that sooner. That's really nice. I said I was going to level up this one point, but I lied for now. We're at the 30 minute mark, so I'm going to cut this video off here and we will continue with the remainder of the newbie zones and back into Old Forest. This time around, we're not going to die, I promise.